What's going on everybody? David here from Blucher's Videos and Collectibles and today I got another video for y'all and this time it is part two of Let's Build a G.I. Joe Vehicle. <laughs> Took me a second to get that out. And uh, the vehicle will be on the G.I. Joe Killer Whale. And uh, very excited about uh, this piece because I finally was able to get me some more parts for this. Um, this vehicle is, will probably take a little longer to complete as it has so many parts and uh, they're pretty pricey so you have to keep an eye on a good deal or unless you have a good buddy, a best friend like mine uh, that I have in my life that uh, helps me get parts that I need for certain vehicles that I own. And uh, my good buddy and my best friend and my brother and uh, known for him for many years and grew up with him and uh, he knows his G.I. Joes and uh, this is one of the one of the two killer whales that he handed down to me earlier this year along with a few other vehicles and uh, since then I've traded a couple of them back to him as one I didn't really want them in my collection <clears throat> because some of the things uh, that were going on with them and he's a lot better at restoration and able to complete certain vehicles than I am and so I was able to trade him back for certain things and one of the few things that I got recently was a bunch of parts for uh, my, my two killer whales and um, so let's go ahead and quickly take a look at the parts that I received Okay, so these are the parts that I received in the trade that I made recently with him. This was, came with a, a, in a lot with the other parts of other vehicles that I needed. And um, also, being the stand-up guy that he is, um, he did order me another set of parts to go to my uh, killer whales. And um, he just said, hey, I got this cheap lot for you. You need them, so you owe me one. So... I do. <laughs> I don't want one. So, but anyway, so yes, uh, happy to receive these things as I got a handful of barrels. I think they only go five per, per vehicle, and I got two of these, so both of them will go to both whales. Uh, I got another set of these that will go to my second one. I got an, uh, another one of these, the panels uh, um, that will go to the second one as well. And I got a complete uh, boat, and um, here is the first one I have. But the only thing I need is to complete this is the uh, shield. And um, also got uh, another set of these cannons. Um, these two will probably go on the first one. This will go on to the second one. Or actually, yeah, these two. I already have one on my ones I'm working on now that we're about to work on. And um, so... The other one I have has a second, uh, uh, or should I say one rocket to it, or missile. So this will go to that, and the missiles will go to the other one. So, yes. So basically, I have two sets of these all together. And then I got a turret right here. I need another one to go to, uh, to complete the second one, the, the uh, other one. And this goes to the window goes into the front of a part of the vehicle and these are highly sought after these are the veins that go in the back that has the uh, the mechanism that you open up for the uh, um, <clears throat> the uh, fans that go in the back and um, this one right here the only thing that's that's really that's hard is uh, this right here this little piece kind of broke so um, it came like that so I, my my buddy Daryl said that he would be able to fix it if I wanted it fixed but uh, we'll see um, so I do got a set of these right here so all I need really is this another one of these and uh, like three more of these and then I'll need the uh, the fans that go along with it so because this part will connect here and then these will connect here and up there as well. So I'll need another set, three three more of these to complete it. So this one's not so bad. It'll probably work. 
So, I mean, I'm not really worried or all that worried about it. So, but yeah. So these are the parts that I got in the, in the lot. So let's go ahead and move these parts aside to bring back the whale. And let's go ahead and put these parts on them. Okay, now we got the, the whale back up here, center piece. So let's go ahead and piece this guy together, or thing together, or boat together. So we will need these, this, not these, this. We'll need this. We will need one of these. And we will need, I think, five of these discharges and we will also need this and the missiles that go with this all right now let's just go ahead and take these out since you can tell in the background we already have those that one right there and i'll just use this one set this aside and we should be good. So let's go ahead and piece some of these things together. Okay, so finally we was able to put all the pieces together. So let's go ahead and take a quick look at it. So I was able to get all five uh, charges on there. And then was able to carefully, but very carefully, uh, stick the missile launcher there. As you know, the... Plastic can be very brittle and uh, can break easily, especially with the clips. That's what a lot of times, a lot of these old GI Joe vehicles, you know, they have the very brittle uh, clip-ons. And if you're not careful, they can be costly and can damage real easily. <clears throat> so, I was able to put the bike there. Got the, like I said, got the five chargers there. And... We turn this vehicle around. I got the turret guns right there and was able to include the window. And then down here, let me set this thing down real quick. And uh, let's see. Over here. Here is where the boat goes. I'm probably going to have to end up replacing this because there is a tab that's missing. As you can see, like, right there, there's the tab, and this one's the broken one. But here is the complete boat, and we would have to insert the boat in there. See if I can. There we go. Also, I need to get a tab that goes right there so when I can launch it, you know. Not that I'm going to launch it anytime soon, but, you know, it's just nice, a nice little piece to have there. And let's put that tab back on there. Let's see, that's why I probably need another one. And they're fairly expensive as well, so they're not cheap at all. So that sets up like that. So uh, there we go. So overall, this thing is looking mighty fine. It's getting there, slowly but surely. So I need a few more pieces to have one complete. And um, yeah, that's what I got so far. So I hope y'all enjoyed part two of Let's Build Your Let's Build a GI Joe Vehicle killer whale and um hopefully i'm able to get some more parts pretty soon and um we'll do another video and um this might take a few parts you know uh, because there's so many parts that needs to be obtained and <clears throat> i'm surprised i was able to get another vehicle or not vehicle another video out this soon because like I said, these parts are very hard to come by and they're not cheap at all. And you have to buy them in, in lots to in order to save a little bit of money. Even the lots go quite a bit. But still, I mean, if you try to buy individual pieces, you, you're spending 
quite a bit, you know. Some not as expensive as others, but others, yeah, it's, it's uh, it all depends on the piece and uh, what you're looking for and how much you want to spend. But, uh, yeah, this, this video or this series for this vehicle will take a, a few few more videos in order to complete it. But I'm very excited because um, I'm very happy and um, just excited to take this journey with you guys. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to complete this together. And um, <clears throat> until next time, um, if you're new to the channel, please give this channel a sub. Like the video if you like it. I hope you all enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making this video. And um, don't forget to hit the notification bell as you receive all my videos as I upload them. And if you like this video, comment down below and let me know if you had this as a kid or if you currently have this in your collection or if you're currently rebuilding it like I am. So, also, where's the wisdom? Buy what you love and not what you like because if you buy what you like, you will always end up getting rid of it. And I'll catch y'all later.